Bonjour, today is Friday, January 1st. Happy New Year. Uh, it's about 11 a.m. and I am just about to leave to go meet my friend Belinda at McGregor uh, Provincial Park. And uh, yeah, there are, damn, I meant to look this up before. I think there's six different trails there. Um, so my plan is to do them all. And I've just texted Belinda asking if she would be into doing a night hike uh, because I've never done that before. And we'll see what she says. I'm sure she'll say yes. So yeah, um, that's about it. I guess I should get going. I should have left much earlier. Now I'm gonna be driving during like the prime hours of the day, but whatever and we are just going to make a quick stop at the laundry room and collect some lint kind of gross but awesome fire starter so we're gonna do it okay I used to get really annoyed at people who like didn't bother to clean their lint thingy like when they were done their load of laundry but now I thank those people look at this I had to like stuff it in there to, to like make it all fit. There's an industrial, we have one industrial washer and one industrial dryer, like for, I don't know, really big loads. And um, the industrial dryer says must be cleaned daily. I don't think it's being cleaned daily. Anyway, that's what most of this is. It's just, it was like a massive sheet of fire starter. Okay, lint, blah, 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 let's go. You buy some, like you stop and buy some firewood and then you stop and fill up your gas tank and it's now almost 12 o'clock and I'm still in Toronto. So I'm only going to have like an hour of um, daylight by the time I get there. So whatever, case sera sera. It is 20 after three. I am just arriving to McGregor Point um, <clears throat> Provincial Park. I thought I had been here before, but now I can tell that I have not and yeah active bear in the area okay. all right so here we are there's Belinda <laughs> and we are going to do um a trail we're gonna do one trail it's only like one point something kilometers and it's easy uh while there's still daylight shall we Right, so we are back at the camp spot. So we did the entire, what was that one called? The Huron Fringe Trail? So the 0.7 kilometers of the Huron Fringe Trail and back and a little bit of extra stuff. And then walking there as well. Anyway, it turned out to be a 3.5 kilometer little walk. And we will continue doing some of the other trails tomorrow. But right now it is time to make a fire because it is going to get dark super quickly. Okay, I have been lazy up till now with my establishing like a proper base for my fires. So I've got like the two big logs to act as like the support. And then I've got lint in the middle and then um, twisted up newsprint and then kindling. And then once that's going, I'll put um, that log on top and hopefully there will be no fire restarting this time. But I am gonna start the fire with the flint, uh, flint and lint like I did last time. goes that was super quick that was like 10 seconds less than 10 seconds I'll wait till that I have to catch a bit more cool man
Oh my god, that looks so cool, actually. Okay, it is 6.32, the fire is burning out. I think we are both ready to head off to our respective tents. And yeah, let's see on the flip side. So this is my first time using my little buddy heater inside my car. I must admit, I feel a little nervous about it. It's like an open flame. Um, but I've got the window cracked. It has a built-in uh, carbon monoxide monitor and tip over like turn off feature. And I'm not gonna keep it on for long. I'm just gonna let things warm up in here. According to Belinda, it shouldn't take very long. Uh, then I'll shut it off. This new setup with a lowered bed, like without the passenger seat. Oh yeah, I didn't even show it yet. I'll show it in the morning. Um, this is way better. Like, this is super comfy. I, I can, like, sit up in here. I can, like, do stuff. Yeah. It, this is, this is as, um, convenient or comfortable as a tent, for sure. So, that's basically what I've been referring to my car as, tra the traveling tent. So, I am loving my new setup. I'm sitting here cross-legged. I've got lots of headspace above me, like still like four or five inches. I don't even have my winter coat on. Um, I've got my little buddy heater. I've got my window cracked open, as I've already said. I'm having a glass of wine. I've got food if I need it or want it. And yeah. I'm just like super comfy. This is amazing. It's lightly snowing outside. I am so happy with this setup. I feel like this video footage looks like that Phil Collins like album cover where it's like just his face. Good morning. Today, today is Saturday. January 2nd, 2021. And uh, yeah. So it only got to like minus one or something last night. It's zero right now. But I did sleep really, really comfortably. Um, I got my, I didn't, I had that on for like an hour as I watched a movie. And then I shut it off and I went to bed. I got the window cracked open. And I'm not sleeping in my, yeah, like I'm just sleeping in normal clothes. Not my whole like um, winter coat and all that stuff. So that's a really great thing. So I just turned it on now. Uh, I didn't even really need to. Just being luxurious. So, yeah. I'm going to go ahead and get up and go to the washroom. And then I'm meeting Belinda for coffee by the campfire at 8 o'clock. So, uh, yeah. I really like my new setup. I can, yeah, chill in here for at least a few hours and, like, be comfortable. So, yay. It snowed like a good, I'd say four inches. Um, it is so pretty out, it's so quiet. Yeah, the sun's just starting to come up. This is amazing. And like judging by the tracks in the snow, I'm like the first person up. Well, the first person who needs to use the washroom anyway. Oh, and by the way, super clean, heated, Amazing washrooms, quite the luxury. Anyway, now it is uh, time for coffee. Yum, can't wait. There's Belinda, she's still in bed, but she will be meeting me here soon.
So B, how far have we walked and how much time? Oh, 6.67 kilometers. 6.159. 6 6.7 what kilometers? 6.67 kilometers and we are at one hour, 51 minutes. Okay. <laughs> What's the name of this trail? It's like I don't have a brain. The Old Shore Road Trail. Old Shore Road Trail. But we are going to start heading back now, eat something, and then drive back to that parking spot and do the wet Kemp Trail, the Pond Trail, whatever it's called, and the, the remaining 2.8 kilometers. Right? Okay, let's do it. Point seven one kilometers, two hours, 59.56. Wow, not a bad way to start the day. Better than a kick in the teeth. Uh, so now it's like almost noon and we are going to eat. We're gonna have some dogs on fire and, uh, and then do some more trails, right? Or take a nap. <laughs> uh, we shall see.
so good so good <gasps> mustard all right we are done lunch belinda and i each ate five hot dogs five no bun or anything just like the dog but uh, still it's a lot um so we are going to drive to the park store and get more firewood and then we're going to drive back to the trailheads and do the something trail the something trail and the something trail all right we are back so um we're here at the lake ridge trail it is four kilometers it's considered a moderate trail it says rough in um brackets and yeah we're gonna start working off those five hot dogs <laughs> What's the count? Uh, 104.3.76 kilometers. 3.76, 104. Cool. Are we going to do another one? <sighs> <sighs> we've done four, no, we've done 15.7 kilometers so far today. So it turns out I am cutting my trip a bit uh, short. Uh, I just don't feel well. So I'm going to go home, but it was good. A little trip and uh, thanks for watching.